Hey, this is Matt here with Learning Farm. Uh, two, three days ago, we had our first calf here on the farm. Uh, we're due fall calving, and uh, I had a few questions, and you know, it's the first experience for me with a new calf, so I had a few things that came up that I was wondering myself, and one of the things I noticed this morning, my calf was born on Wednesday, and it's, it's Sunday now, so uh, four days old. One of the questions I had was, I was pushing my cows up, I, I got them up to get her out of the weeds, bring them up to the uh, hay ring to check them out, and uh, uh, the calf and the mama stopped, and the calf, the calf, uh, uh, lack of a better word, it pooped right in front of me, so it made me think, I wonder if that's normal or not, you know, I, I, didn't, I don't know, so looked on the internet looking for some pictures, and there's some descriptions and things like that, and that's kind of a, maybe a gross subject, but it's pretty important to know, considering if you don't know what scours are, you should look that up. Uh, and that could be a, a big problem. Milk fever uh, is another thing that can cause some uh, th uh, problems. And through the stool, you can you can find out if, if that's going on or if you're having an issue with it. So what I did is it's been about 30 minutes ago. I had to go inside and get the camera and come back out and get everything together. <clears throat> um, I'm going to show you the what a normal cow stool looks like for a calf. Um, like I said, my calf is four days old. So um, what it should look like, consistency. If you have a if you have a weak stomach, you might not want to watch this one, but uh, it's kind of a you know might be a gross subject to some people, but it's very important. I want I want to show you what a normal uh, stool looks like. Now my calf is four days old. I had a little bull calf. Uh, his mom is about six years old. Not her first calf, obviously. Uh, she's she's uh, nursing. Everything's going fine. She's mom has a good bag. They're both healthy. Everything's went smooth. She had the calf on her own. So this is what a normal stool looks like. I'll show you here. Like I said, if you have a weak stomach, you might not want to watch this. So. All right, right here is a normal calf stool. Uh, I can see the color. It's been about 30 minutes, so it's drying a little bit, but the color is a yellowish, uh, brownish yellow color. Um, and uh, that, that's that's about where, where you want this to be at. Uh, it's a... Uh, I'll, I'll show you kind of the consistency here in a second, too. So uh, let me get you lined up. There we go. All right. Now, we will show the consistency of this thing so you can kind of see what to what to expect here. So, uh, you can see it's it's a, a little soft, but you really should have like a pudding consistency. Maybe I'd say that's probably the best way to describe it. Uh, you can see it's not watery at all. Uh, it's got a yellow color. That's what it looked like originally. Um, got a yellow color to it. Little like a uh, little bit of a pudding, like I said. Uh, much thinner than Play-Doh, not watery at all. That's a good, normal stool right there. So that kind of gives you an idea uh, what that looks like and uh, what, to, what to expect when you have calves. Uh, much more watery than this, you need to worry about scours. And uh, you can look up the treatment for that um, and, and how to care for that. Uh, there are different things. People, I've, I've heard some Pepto-Bismol. Uh, if, you're, if you're giving your cows, like you're bottle feeding them, you can put it in the, in the milk. I've heard that. Of course, electrolytes are pretty important, um, and a lot of calves can get over it. It's just a matter of time consuming and a lot of a lot of treatment. So, but this is what a normal stool looks like. Uh, if you got any comments or tips for me, um, any questions that maybe I can help you out with that I've experienced, uh, leave a comment below. And uh, I hope this helps some people out, and uh, maybe a little bit easier through this video, you can kind of identify the normal bowel movement of a of a calf. So, there you go. If you need anything else, let me know. Thank you.